Oh my God. But we had to see you one last time. Disney, what is this? Uh, Checking in to the Disneyland Hotel right now. They redecorated the entire hotel for the 100th anniversary. So they, have, they have all the banners up of the Fab Five. I'm excited to be here. <laughs> Oh, it is good to be back. Look at this carpet for the 100th Disney 100 Years of Wonder. It looks like a giant red carpet leading you up. They have the statues of Mickey and Minnie. And they always change out the stuff in the front. You get all the classics that Walt helped create. There's a little picture of Alice right there. I like the little light fixtures, the little uh, stars right there. Ooh, where are we going, Keith? Hi. Now here's a little shot of the bed. So you have the fireworks. A dream is a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. You can see you got some hidden Mickeys right there. And then the headboard lights up. There's little like LEDs inside. So I play some music and the fireworks go off. Welcome. Banks Junior Party. So you got the TV over here. You got some drawers. This should be the mini fridge right down there. You got a funky looking mirror right here. On the light fixture, you have a little hidden Mickey right down here. A nice desk. Everybody always freaks out about the USBs. They have those too. And they do have in-room dining. This stuff is super expensive. I don't suggest doing it. But if you want um, a Mickey-shaped waffle, it'll cost you $25 plus tip. Coasters all have the Disneyland Hotel on them. Keurig with coffee. We got the bathroom, right? This feels very 90s Eisner era with the, like the Mickey hand. Little hidden Mickeys on the lampshade. Again, these like funky like Mickey mirrors. I got a little mirror for you. On the handles on the sink, there's a little hit of Mickey's. And then I like this over here. It's all the soap, but it's got Walt. He says, neat and ready. Here's the shower. Pretty decent kind of basic shower. Nothing too crazy. On the little knob though, there is the hit of Mickey. Nice little private bathroom. We have a little picture of Dumbo. This is one of Jared's favorite photos of all time. It's of Walt walking underneath the castle here in Disneyland. We're all about quality here, what do we see? Oh my, it's it's giving me uh, flashbacks to Fullerton's Hojo. <laughs> okay, there's a Band-Aid on the smoke detector. Why, Disney, what is this? Look at that. <laughs> like, we're about to head off to Disneyland. Kinda looks like it's like 3D printed and kind of painted, but the topiaries here are always great. You have Minnie, Mickey, and Pluto. I'm about to walk underneath the sorcerer hat. One of the best things about staying at the Disneyland Hotel is it's connected pretty much to downtown Disney. We went right down our elevator and then here's security to take you right in downtown Disney. A bunch of new artwork. They just took the Mickey that was outside D23 this year and just put it here in downtown Disney. But here's a bigger version of the medallion. It just looks unfinished. I don't know. I'm not a fan of this design for the 100th of these medallions. Now we just got the new park ticket. I'm digging the vibe. Uh, we're hopping on the monorail first. They're not loading the back right now, but we're pretty close. Disneyland monorail. Just like that, we've uh, made it to Tomorrowland. Look at that view. That is so cool with the Matterhorn in the back. Oh, there's the iridescent monorail. Look how good that wrap looks on it. The whole squad in the back. They did a really good job with that wrap. Now, one of my favorite things here at Disneyland is the Disneyland Band. They're amazing.
love the Disneyland band so much. We just think it looks like they just cut up a bunch of CDs and uh, put it up as decorations on Main Street. Hop it into the Emporium real quick. They just released all the Oswald stuff today. For unnamed price, they have Oswald ears. The ears just kind of remind me of like burnt Olive Garden breadsticks. For $65, they have an Oswald hoodie. For $60, they have this little sculpture of Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. $28, they have Oswald ears. For $60, they have this button up t-shirt. says Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. It's got a little pocket with it. It kind of reminds me of just a cow, but when you look closely, it's Oswald's ears. For $40, they have an Oswald bag. And then over here, it's like Oswald drawing, but it's gonna be kind of like a long neck beard jersey. You're looking at $60 for this long sleeve like sweater. For $20, they have an Oswald mug. For $35, they have an Oswald black t-shirt. $30, they have an Oswald skyscraper water bottle. It's kind of reminds me of like the Peeps bunnies, but it's a Oswald little pillow for $40. So we got a blanket for $60. And for $45, this is gonna be the back of the long sleeve shirt. Then they have Oswald on the front. For $60, they have this button up shirt. It's gonna be a Mickey Mouse all time classic. Then for $20, they have this little water bottle. For $35, they have this tie dye goofy shirt. And they have a tie dye one for Donald. For $30, they have this Disneyland Resort blue t shirt. Then for $25, they have this Disneyland baseball cap. For $60, they have an Oswald lamp. One of the other new things is here they have the Disney Gallery presents Disney 100 Years of Wonder. Mickey looks so dapper in his new outfit. He looks so good. They have a multi-plane camera over here. There's some footage in an old TV. It's one of the old animator's desks from Walt Disney Animation. You can see in the back, it's like the storyboard. So this is filled of just all different types of like concept art. This is what the Storybook Land Canal could have looked like. They have Tim Burton's Dumbo here, Peter Pan's Flight, Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. Here's the old hag. Here's Walt with the Matterhorn in the background, and then here's the concept art for the Matterhorn that they built. Never seen this concept art for Jungle Cruise. Here comes entertainment, Walt Disney, most exciting true life adventure the african lion didn't they originally want to have like real life animals in the jungle cruise then they went to animatronics some of the concept art in the indiana jones adventure this is a really cool setup so you got the speakers right here but this got tinkerbell right there and then above is disneyland you got the tv right there they have concept art for star tours I've never seen some of this stuff. This looks like that scene straight out of Boba Fett. Ah, uh, if only we got that Quinjet ride. It was gonna be amazing from what I was hearing about it. Look at this Pirates concept art. I've never seen most of this stuff here. This is worth coming here, enjoying some AC and looking at all this concept art for all the Disneyland attractions. Disneyland news, 50,010 Gala Park opening. Now off to the side, they have kind of the art gallery, but one of the cool things, you can come in and see them drawing some of the characters. So he's working on Kevin right there. This is a cool print of the Haunted Mansion, right? You have the hitchhiking ghost down there. And yes, uh, Disneyland still is selling the stolen art of the Tiki Room drummer. This used to be an actual working bank here at the park, but they turned the safe into something like special. They always have like these very expensive things for sale. Here's a Walt Disney's autograph on a check. It'll only run you $22,000. Okay, we're heading out of Disneyland, heading off to California Adventure. We'll show off some of, some of the other 100th anniversary decorations. But the main reason, we gotta go get my favorite food on the entire planet, lobster nachos. On my deathbed, I want lobster nachos. But we're switching up this time. You guys told me to try something new. I'm gonna let you know how it is. So they have all those banners up of the Fab Five along the walkway into the entrance of California Adventure. So then above the California Adventure archway, it's that same kind of medallion. Now in the center place over here, over here at the planters, they have another giant medallion for people to take a photo with. Drain this, uh, they're gonna be turning into San Francisco. I think they'll just probably put up some stickers and they're putting like, I think kind of like two more attachments to the bridge. So it's not gonna be a major overhaul, it's gonna be a slight re-theme, I think, for San Francisco. We're headed into Pixar Pier and here we are. The heavenly gates of Lamplight Lounge. Lamplight Lounge. So one of my favorite things about here is every coaster is different. It's kind of like concept art. Here's like Bow, a little otter right there. A little Pizza Planet alien, so it's always kind of fun. Do what character you get every single time. The problem is, I can't really drink alcohol today. The paint colors and stuff. So. Okay, time out real quick. Uh, you're probably wondering why I look a little uh, out of it. This is the first day of our trip. We're gonna go back in time for this wonderful kidney stone saga. I was at the hospital until 3 a.m. We did five rounds of morphine. I was on Percocet. I was on a whole little cocktail of medications. I left the hospital at three, got the airport at five. We flew to California, went directly to Disneyland. If I look a little out of it, that's why. All right, now, uh, now back to the video. So uh, we 
went mocktail today. So I got the Falling with Style Minute Maid Lemonade with a mango puree. Minute Maid Lemonade with some uh, like mango syrup. Nothing crazy, but it's fine. 7.5. My two go one was always just kind of the lobster and the chicken. You guys said I gotta try it with the carne asada, the holy trinity, the chicken, the lobster, the carne asada. Oh my god. This is so good. This is so fry. It's so good. 10 out of 10. Wonderful as always. It's a must. Is it a $36 set of notches? Yes. Is it amazing? Yes. It's worth it. You get kind of the tender juiciness from the carne asada in there. The wonderful pulled chicken and the very smoky lobster. It's one of the best things on Disney property. You gotta come get it. Keith is on drink number three. Wait, what's the name of your drink? What's your go-to now? The sequel. What's in it? I don't know. It's passion fruit. That's it. The rum. But it's up. Keith is on his third drink. I've never seen him drink more than two in my entire life, and I lived with the man. So we're gonna experience something together. He's, he's vibing right now. You're you're vibing to the Pixar music. Oh, this is gonna be an interesting day. Keith just looked at the bill. What did you say? <laughs> my money. Welcome to going out and drinking, buddy. Where's the disco? You don't get discounts on alcohol. No. <laughs> I think he's about to pay full price. We pay full price! I get paid tomorrow so much. <laughs> and what is it at? <laughs> he just currently uh, passed the $100 in tricks. Oh my god. It's the proper way on how to put a paper straw into this sequel. Mix it all around. How would you best describe this drink, Keith? Better than apple juice. Let's see. Jeremiah, what's our fun Oswald fact of the day? So, as it turns out, in 2006, Disney CEO Bob Iger made a deal with NBC slash Universal to obtain the rights to Oswald for the studio. The deal included permitting sportscaster Al Michaels to contract with NBC in exchange for the return of Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. It looks like we not, might not be able to meet him. It's okay. So who, Estonia is, is here too. I know nothing about Estonia. It's okay. She, she looks cool. Estonia, the it's uh, a, a cheerful ladylike cat. Hortensia. Hortensia makes friends wherever she goes. She looks for the close. best in any situation and always puts others first. Oh my gosh, you look stunning today. It is the final day of Lunar New Year. We're a little sad, but we had to see you one last time. Now, Jeremiah over here, he wore a special shirt. Let's see. Oh, yes. They need to make one of you for next year. Yes. Next year, yeah. Yes. Some ears. Oh, that'd be lovely. <laughs> How was it? I saw you blush in there. I didn't know you were gonna put me on the spot like that. But I, I never put my friends on the spot. I, I never. Read the words like I was just like sitting there and I was chilling and all of a sudden the spotlight was on me and I just I buckled and I I'm surprised that I just was even to get some you words out. So now the Lunar New Year parade is coming. Uh, we're on the hunt for this like hot dog pretzel thing in the shape of a Mickey. But let's watch this first. It's our honor to share the beautiful Chinese traditions and heritage of this joyous holiday. The Lunar Power is a comforting symbol. The Spirited Dragon Dance is one of Mulan's favorite traditions. 
she learned from her ancestors that the wise and powerful dragon dances across the sky to scare away bad luck and bring good fortune. The ribbon dance was performed for loyalty as an expression of gratitude and honor. Olaf loves the swarthy colors of the ribbons. Great and honor. Aswad! Yeah, look at Chip and Dale. Look at Chip. We celebrate the year of the crap. The moving flowers that come to us in the fall. Mm -hmm. Now there's one Lunar New Year treat I've spotted for ages and I've always wanted to try it. It's like a, this weird Mickey hot dog thing. The Mickey Mouse shaped hot dog bun. Brio style Mickey Mouse shaped bun filled with hot dogs and finished with sesame seeds and scallions. It looks like a nice fluffy little doggy. Like a pig in a blanket sort of a pretzel. Pretty decent. Love the hot dog. The hot dog's in there, wonderful. Season in there, nice and juicy. The pretzel itself, it has a very good aftertaste, but it's also very like dry. You need to drink like a bottle of water or have a drink with that pretzel because it's kind of hard to get through just on its own. So it's an 8.5. We're on our way to Radiator Springs Racers right now. Right, here we go. Yeah, the standby queue is going all the way back to the front entrance. Cool. All right, we're hopping into a yellow car. Man, nothing can beat this view. This is one of the most beautiful views on any ride. I wish I knew. We hopped over to Disneyland real quick because they're right next to each other before World of Color. Uh, Keith has eaten half of it already, but uh, we're here at the uh, Tropical Hideaway. What do you want to say, Keith? This is delicious. This is a lemonade menu item over at Adventureland. It's strawberry candela cake and strawberry sauce. Use a little more cake in it, but I would say eight out of 10. Uh, the ceiling here in Adventureland is leaking. Okay, it's time to watch the new World of Color show. It's called World of Color One. It's not the first one. They've had multiple worlds of color. Uh, maybe this is the greatest one of all time. What's your favorite thing about being a cast member? Uh, making magic. We got a magical moment, and we got VIP for World of Color. It's magic. The magic is real. We got fruit. We got treats. We got waters. Uh, we're able to sit down and watch World of Color. Friends and family gather together to welcome a bright new. All your family and friends will welcome you this New Year's Day. So hurry home, little lantern. Don't let the dragon Mushu lead you astray. 
May a banquet of deliciousness mean good luck will be increased. So make your way home, little lantern. Imagine a most delightful feast. upon our past and wish upon the brand new year. My greatest reward is to have the, the public appreciate and accept what I've done all these years. That, that is a great reward. One man, one dream. One hundred years ago, Walt Disney set records of happiness and imagination in motion. He showed us how little ripples can become great ways. It just takes one.
remember one time my dad took me to this jazz club. That's when I knew I was born to play.
just in a sort of dress rehearsal. We're just getting started. That's the closest you can get to like heaven on earth. It's like uh, if you're on acid watching Disney. It's just so beautiful and gorgeous. I do kind of like the flow and the pacing of the original world of color better with the music choices and how that works. But visually and like the technologies with the lasers and the lighting, they knocked it out of the park with this. But I think storytelling wise, I think the OG world of color is better. <laughs> okay, we finished. The kidney stone is back with a vengeance right now. Uh, I just took the painkiller. We're struggling right now, but oh God, that was so good. Um, again. This is two times in a row I've come to Disneyland and I had a magical moment that's super special, memorable, that you will talk about for the rest of your life, right? And you go to Disney World and nothing ever happens. You never have any magical moments. The magic is still alive here at Disneyland, but at Disney World, it's just kind of dead and decrepit. There's no really magic left. Let's hop over and go see the Grand Californian lobby because they normally have some special stuff. There's 350 pounds of Rice Krispies, 150 pounds of marshmallows. So it looks like they're in front of the Disneyland castle, right? It's a really detailed sculpture. I think they did do a pretty good job. They butchered our boy, the Jazz Kitchen. What is this monstrosity? This is terrible. Why do they do this? I'm scared to see what it looks like when it's fully renovated. There's no life, there's no soul. Okay, now guys, we are back at home. Again, I just had a blast at Disneyland. There's a lot of great offerings for the 100th anniversary at Disneyland. Disney has their nighttime shows down. The New World of Color is great. And it was also my first time going for Lunar New Year at Disney's California Adventure. A lot of fun. I kind of want to go back next year and kind of experience the full food festival and everything they had to offer. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. If you have not already, hit the subscribe button. Join the family. I, I love, love the family. Because I'm going to keep you up to date on all things Disney and theme park around the country. I love you all, and I'll see y'all very soon. Baby, I put you so right here is where the statue was. Disney infamously misprinted it, and they've removed the statue.